morning guys. Today is Friday and I have another day off work. Today I'm actually getting my extensions fitted um, for the wedding because I want long hair for the wedding. Today's video is 24 hour glow up. I feel like I've been feeling a bit gross at work this week. My skin is number one. I have no nails on. I'm just generally feeling like a bit meh. So today's video is 24 hour glow up and I'm going to take you on the journey of this to this. So let's get into the video. So basically I've literally just showered and washed my hair because she wants my hair to be clean um, for when she puts the extensions in later so I am now just about to put some cream on my face I'm not going to do too much of my skin right now I'm going to do that later but I'm just going to put some cream on my face um, and I'm going to head up to get my nails done first because I think I've mentioned before but I'm so impatient at the nail shop so I want to go up quite early so that I'm not waiting too long um, and my nails look so gross outfit today please mm, just forget about this mess but I literally am um, really chilled today. Um, couldn't really be bothered getting ready. But I tried to show you. I finally got. You can't even see them. Um, my pink vans. I've been looking for these vans. Um, for so long. And I could. I mean, I could have ordered them online. But um, I was determined to find them in the shop. And I finally found them. So now I have them. Um, so yeah, I'm going to really quickly put some cream on my face and then I'm going to head out to the nail shop. Nails are done. They look really pretty. They're kind of a bit peachier than I thought they were going to be. I went for really short because I can't stand long nails. I literally can't do anything. Like I can't type at work or can't do anything. So they're quite short. Um, yeah, as I said, peachier than I wanted. But I'm thinking that with a tan, they look even nicer. So yeah, I'm now really hungry. It's breakfast time. My hairdresser has actually called and said she wants me to come in a bit earlier in about an hour. So I'm just sat outside the shops. And I'm going to run in and get some ingredients to make breakfast with. Um, I'm going to make a really yummy breakfast because I feel like eating some yummy, healthy food to make me feel good. So I'm going to pop into the shops and get that now. Okay, so what I bought is bread, eggs, chilies, and avocado. And basically, I'm gonna make poached eggs on toast with um, smashed avocado and fresh chili. I'm gonna make that now, and I will show you how I do that. So the first thing I'm gonna do is poach the eggs. So I'm going to crack the egg, this is really hard to do with just so I'm going to cut the avocado and smash it and add in the chilies to 
that. So I'm going to do that now whilst the egg is poaching and the toast is on. Okay, sorry, one second. So finished product, usually there would be a big bunch of spinach here, but there isn't. It doesn't look that yummy, but it is so delicious. This is really spicy. And then, yep, yum, 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 yum. So I'm now gonna eat this. That was, honestly, delish. That was a bit too many chilies, my mouth is on fire. But it was so yummy and now I feel like I've eaten something yum and healthy. Um, so yeah, that's literally just like a quick breakfast that I always tend to whip up on the weekend when I have time to actually make breakfast. Um, so I have my hair appointment for extensions in about 20 minutes. So I'm going to go and straighten my hair because currently it's in a bun and... Um, yeah, go and get the extension. She said it's going to take three hours, which is a really long time. Um, so I, yeah, I'll take you with me. And hopefully when I come out, I'll have luscious long locks. morning whoa that is bright it's now the next day um and i have my hair extensions in they look so lush like i'll show you in a minute in the mirror but um basically it took like four hours for them to be put in yesterday um but i'm so happy with them i think they look so good um, I got them done at a local salon by um, a girl called Chelsea McGregor. Her salon is called Bangs Boutique and she honestly did such a good job. So I'm so happy with them. It was so worth the four hours in the salon. Um, let me try and show you properly. It's not very good lighting. I mean, I've slept on them. She curled them so beautifully um, yesterday. And I'll put a little picture here. That is what they looked like yesterday. They looked so good. I haven't done anything with them today. Like, I literally just woke up. Um, you can actually see in the mirror there what they look like. Can you see them? Yeah, you kind of can see them. Um, but they honestly look so good. Um, and I'm so happy with them. Uh, so, yeah. That is the hair step of the glow up check. I'm now going to move on to do my skin, I'm going to tan and I'm also then going to do my makeup and just um, kind of run over my hair a little as well before I go out. So on to skincare. Okay so I've just tied my hair up for a minute. I'm not going to lie, recently my skin has been so bad. It's not even recently actually, it's been like I'd say for the past couple few even more than that months my skin has just been horrendous and i never used to have bad skin and um, so i don't know really know where it's come from actually have tried so many different skincare products and um yeah i'm using kind of a variety i'm just gonna um cleanse my face and then put some 
creams on it. So the cleanser that I'm using, I got it when I was in California on offer, but you definitely can get Clarins wherever. And there we go. It is Clarins Paris Gentle Foaming Cleanser um, for dry or sensitive skin. I don't actually have particularly dry or sensitive skin, but so basically, I think I may have used this in another vlog, but I'm just going to put this on my face. Okay, so that's basically on. I tend to get spots worse on my chin, on my forehead, and around my nose. So I'm just making sure I rub it. And then I take a face brush. This is actually the wrong one. So I actually have two. Two brushes have this one and this one. This one um, has these little things in it and it's quite soft, whereas this one is really hard. So I tend to use this one because I really like to scrub my face. So I'm just going to take this with some warm water, scrub it all off, and then just splash some cold water on my face. This goes over here because it's much better lighting. But yeah, I've literally just cleared it off my skin. Um, my skin already feels way better and I'm now going to put some products on. I'm going to show you some of the products that um, I've been using recently that have worked so well. Um, basically they're Your Good Skin range. I'm going to focus. And basically um, my best friend Katie recommended them to me because she'd used them before. And I, it was three for two in Superdrug so I got the Overnight Cream. The balance, Balancing Skin Concentrate, which is supposed to, this one is supposed to, within 28 days, um, restore your natural skin tone. Um, and then this one, which is honestly a godsend. Like, I can't describe to you, like, these spots here, if you'd seen me maybe, like, two weeks ago, they were so much worse. Um, but basically, you put a tiny bead of it. On your finger and put it directly on the spot and I'm not gonna lie it does really hurt like it stings but it is so good so I'd highly recommend this highly recommend um so yeah so I'm not gonna put the night one or the the rapid rescue treatment on right now but I am gonna use this balancing skin concentrate and a little bit goes a long way so I'm just gonna rub that into my skin. Next step, now that is in, the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to tan. So I'm stuck between Wonder Sands One Hour Express or Garnier, which is probably not as popular one, but I swear by this. It's a gradual um, tanning lotion, but if you put it on before you go to bed and then wake up the next morning, like you're really bronzed. And honestly, I've never ever had a streaky tan with this stuff. So I'd highly recommend this. Um, I'm about to go out um, to see my family after this. So I'm probably not gonna put this one on just because it tends to make me go a bit green till I wash it off. So I'm gonna stick with this one today. Um, so I'm gonna go put this on. Okay, I'm back. Tan is done. Um, I also don't look tanned right now because it's gradual. Now that's joining the video. You're my little baby. Good girl. Um, so yeah, tan is done. Um, it will take a couple of hours and then I will be nice and tanned. Put it on my face as well. I always put it on my face. For some reason, I don't know what's in that tan, but I always do find if I put it on my face, it that improves my skin as well. I don't know if it's some ingredient that's in it, but it seems to improve my skin as well. So I'm now gonna do my makeup. I'm not going anywhere special, so I'm not gonna do too much, but I'll do a little, a little bit.
Okay, now we are at the end of the video. Um, thank you. I hope you enjoyed this 24-hour glow up. Um, if you did, please give it a thumbs up. And um, next week's video is going to be a really fun one. It's going to have Katie and Anthony in it, and it's going to be a challenge video. Um, and we're filming that tomorrow, so that will be up next Sunday. I then go on my hem party to Barcelona, so I'm kind of in two minds whether or not to um, vlog it, but that could be a possible video. And then after that, I have something planned for the um, vlog for the YouTube channel. I want my videos to be about something in particular, so I have something in mind that I want my channel to start being more about I'm still gonna post really like random videos and vlogs and travel stuff but there is something I feel quite passionately about um, that I'm gonna start posting some videos about so please watch out for that but for now thank you again for watching and I will see you in my next video